Hey guys and welcome back to our save review day. We're gonna be reviewing Conflict PE Prison 13.1. I know I reviewed this server like a week ago or whatnot, but the reason I'm reviewing it again is because well this server has had a major major revamp. There's so many things added there and whatnot and it's really cool so I want to show, show you guys it this episode so yeah let's get started. If you don't know what prison is it's basically a game where you out in a prison and your goal is to get money you get money by mining fighting trading etc after you get a certain amount of money you can rank up and go to the next warp there are currently now i think there are 10 warps or 8 on this server and after you reach a certain amount of money you can rank up go to the next warp and just move on just keep ranking up until you become the richest person on the server that's basically what prison is so let's start the review okay so the developers and owners of the server have added an another warp which is warp i i haven't seen it yet and i can't see it because i make i'm doing a series on the server and i'm still on warp c as you can see here so i'm i'm not really that powerful i can't really check out all the warps but what i can check out is these three things here lottery crates plots and shop these are all the new things added to the server which make it really really awesome there also there's also pvp arena a new arena which i'll show you okay so first let's start with the lottery crate so let's go here okay let's go let's see this okay so here's the lottery place here sorry if it's not loading but my chunks are a bit glitched right now Okay, so let's see here. So if you want to do that, we have to get slime ball. So let me get slime ball, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, never mind. I just noticed that these things are not open yet, which kind of sucks, but they will be fixed soon. I hopefully they will be fixed soon. They're really awesome. So what they do basically is that you put a slime ball in the chest, and they give you a random item. Sometimes it's gonna be like. Something really awesome like diamond, sometimes it's just gonna be something normal like coal and whatnot. So yeah, that's it for the lottery chest, I mean crates. So next let's go to the shop. Um the shop on the original server was just some some food and whatnot. Now it has really really grown. There are like some blocks, there's crap on food and whatnot. And yeah, oh hey dude, hey dude. Okay, look at this, there's a crap on food. You got some new tools, some new blocks. This is awesome. So let's go up here. Let's see, I haven't really checked up here yet. So what's up? Oh, well, WTF. What's going on? Okay, we're up here. Good. Okay, so what's this? I haven't really checked this yet, have I? Okay. Okay, so this is probably going to be the place where you sell stuff. What about down here? Plot. Oh, plot shop. Okay, so. So let's go to plot. So I'll show you guys. This is probably the coolest addition to Silver yet. I love this addition. This is probably the best thing the best thing they've added. Which is plots. Which I love this. The idea that you can buy on plots. So let's go to the plots area first. Okay, let's go here. And let's enter the plots area. Okay, how how did you do that? I forgot. I tap this right. Hello. Work. Wasn't working. Why isn't working? Oh, okay guys, I want to go to the plot area and I'll be right back. Okay, so down here, if you guys haven't noticed yet, there is like a bit of like arena here, so what I'm to do is I have to jump down. Okay, so let's, um, okay. The thing is, I'm, as I said, I'm doing a series on this server and I hate, I would hate losing stuff, but you know what? First video, let's just go. Join them all. Oh, and I'm gonna die. Thank you. So, just over here, you can PvP your heart out. You can do, you can just fight it out. You can, like, get stuff from people. You can get really cool items and whatnot. So, that's pretty much it. So, but, but well, that's pretty much it, really. Nothing much. It's really well designed. I give it that. The person who helps to build the server really is a really well designer. Look at this. Like, the mines, the arenas, just... Everything looks beautiful on the server. If you want a server which just looks beautiful to play on, this server is the one for you. 
So yeah, this is basically it for the PvP arena. Let's move on. Okay, we are the warp area and look at this place. This is awesome. As you can see, there are warps here and and you can see that there have been people using the, the plots. Look at this house. Well, it's not the best, but you know, it's pretty good, pretty good. Look at these people here. They've gone ham on these plots. Look at this. These guys, the people who own the plot are probably some of the richest people on the server. Look at these places. Wow, the person who owns this plot must be a really great builder. I gotta be honest. Okay. So yeah, this is probably the first server I know of that uses plots. And it's really awesome. Like, I don't think you can find any other server that uses plots this well. Like, most servers usually just protect the area, but sometimes it gets griefed and whatnot, which sucks. But this server, is meant, you can check out other people's houses and whatnot. Look at this. You can see, you can, you can, you can recognize who's the better builder here. Look at this. Oh wait, what? So about that? I wonder if I don't think this is made by Survivor. I think th this is made by the owner, maybe or other developers. But this is really big. I don't think a normal player would make something like that. Okay, but there's a catch. Even though there are plots which are really cool, there is one, one really downfall which will be a bit hard for everyone. That the plots cost. Okay, where's the price here? Ah, uh, it's over here. It costs 5 million to get a plot. 5 million. I have, I have like 1,000. So, if, if you really want a plot, you have to work really hard for it, which is kind of understandable because plots aren't that easy to get. And to be honest, they're really cool. So, if you really want a plot, if, we, if you really want to get a place where you can just build a house or whatnot on the server you have to get 5 million which isn't that bad to be honest so yeah that's pretty much it for all the additions to the server as I said before this server is a really awesome server please check it out it's like one of the best servers in Minecraft Pocket I just really love this server it's really addicting and whatnot so yeah okay that's it for my server review hope you guys enjoyed please leave a like a comment and subscribe for more and yeah see you guys later bye